When trying to describe the 2013 Honda CRZ, you kind of get caught between first and second base. The problem is, a Honda describes it as a sport hybrid, when really it's not very sporty, nor does it offer the same levels of fuel economy that hybrids do. But we think the word quirky is the word that hits the nail on the head. Despite its size, the interior design of the CRZ can accommodate a tall driver and a passenger, with comfortable seats made from quality soft materials. That's right, a passenger. The CRZ is an urban commuter, not a practical daily driver. We think the EX is the best choice. That will give you a powerful 360 watt audio system and the option of the six and a half inch touchscreen. All CRZs are equipped with steering wheel mounted controls, Bluetooth connectivity, and a USB input for your iPod. In a nutshell, the 130 horsepower system with its recently upgraded lithium ion batteries gives the CRZ added thrust when accelerating. An idle stop feature shuts the engine off at rest and re engages it when the brake pedal is released. And the CRZ is the only hybrid in the U.S. market with a six speed manual transmission standard. A CVT or automatic continuously variable transmission is optional. Fuel economy is good, but not astounding. 19,975 dollars gets you into a base CRZ. Other cars to look at include the Toyota Prius C, the Mazda 2, and the Kia Rio. The 2013 Honda CRZ fits somewhere between a hatchback and a runabout while delivering some of the latest in-car technology. Small inside, but eye-catching enough to stand out from other subcompacts, the CRZ is aimed at the urban driver who cares about the environment but still wants to experience the joy of motoring.